The Chiefs getting an A from Pete, as do the Jets. Look in their first round, they got a whole bunch of people. Sauce Gardner, Garrett Wilson uh, traded up to get Jermaine Johnson and right off the bat got Brees Hall there in the second round. I talked to Emory Hunt. He said, I think this is a more talented roster than the Patriots. I don't know what you think about that, but what do you think about the A for the Jets? Uh, no, I think it's fair, especially with what they did in the first round. I mean, you checked off so many boxes that you needed. You needed a cornerback. You needed a big playmaker, wide receiver, especially considering that now kind of throws out the window getting Debo Samuel to come in, right? You get Jermaine Johnson, too, <clears throat> because you need help off of the edge. And you get Brees Hall coming in there uh, as a running back to help take some of the pressure off Zach Wilson. Jeremy Ruckert uh, is going to have a better NFL career than he had a college career because of that offense at Ohio State. I mean, top down again. At every single level, you either have impact starters immediately or guys who are going to add depth and add to this group. But Garrett Wilson's the one that stood out to me. Because I think in year two with Zach Wilson, the way year one looked, you needed to get him a playmaker. You needed to find him someone that he can rely on within this group to make some plays down the field and see what you have in Zach Wilson. I mean, nowadays, too, after that third year, and I know we're a couple years away from that, you have to make that big decision on the fifth-year option. I think after year two, they're going to have a pretty good idea of what Zach Wilson is because of the weapons they've given him. I'm with you, Brady. I, I thought they did an outstanding job, job of trying to build this around that quarterback. Uh, one knock, uh, you know, maybe at some point take an offensive lineman a little earlier. They have questions at the right tackle position, but uh, I like what they did. And, and the best thing they did was I know there was some talk about trading that number 10 pick to San Francisco with some additional picks to get Debo Samuel. This will work out well for them because Garrett Wilson will play and play well, and he'll be a lot cheaper. So I thought they had an outstanding draft as well. during the draft how uh, me and BMAC were, were more on the trade for Debo Samuel wagon and you you thought they should go with Garrett Wilson. I think you're right. Garrett Wilson is going to be a really good football player. And, and as Brady noted, now it's Zach Wilson's turn to prove that he is worth being that, that top uh, that number two overall pick that he was last season. Uh, last season was rough for him for a lot of reasons. You have to hope Makai Becton comes back and, and can fill that left tackle void. They do have uh, Max Mitchell there. He's not going to be able to, to pencil in a left tackle anyway, but he'll provide some depth. But again, it comes down to, to Zach Wilson turning the corner and, and bringing it all together in year two. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.